Is that just your daytime running lights? Uh, well, yeah, the daytime run lights come on as well, like, but on there, look, you can put, say, auto, and it scrolls through all the different things you can do. There's over 200 <laughs> different... Uh, Who make them? A guy called James, Monkey Wrench Bespoke, he's called. Does he just take the original headlights? Six, I uh, just does all the... Um, Modify them himself? I uh, inject it. You can, you, there's no two sets the same. Really? No. Every single set's bespoke. Oh, she's a set of them, then, roughly. 1200 quid. Hi there. Hi. Right, oh, you've got your hair uh, stripes over, didn't you, Seed? I uh, know, I'm funny, like. Standing for stuff, haven't you? You've got to have the stripes, like. <laughs> you've got to earn your stripes if I put the stripes right. in, haven't you? I tell you that, like, I always hoover stripes in. I can't get them that they mount you a matter of bit shit for that, like, they don't. Not like the Ford ones. You've not got genuine Ford ones? Uh, I have, but I've got them, like, in the packet in the loft. Hi there. <laughs> can I take this chat off? Yeah, I'm doing that, do you know, well. Oh, is that dog shite on your mats? Oh, oh. oh. No, is it? I think it is, alright. <laughs> yeah. Maybe it'll just ding you off, man. Be alright. Oh, no animals, fancy not picking your dog shite, man. <laughs> <laughs> you got a McDonald's rag out. <laughs> McDonald's rag? <laughs> I've got loads of rags, mate. We'll just have to hide it in the bed. I'll take the skiddies out. <laughs> <laughs> right, <laughs> They read and these boots that get clumped and clipped everywhere again. What's a script on that? What do we do, like? Does it just drive about? You'll have to tell us what I can, like, because it's a bit around here. Hi, fellas, welcome back. I'm here with Christian. He just brought his Mark II Focus RS. What year is it, mate? 2010. 2010. And, it, like, when you see it, right, it is immaculate, isn't it? Aye, it is so. immaculate. But you've had the full car painted, haven't you? Aye, full bare metal. I got the car and it was. I mean, it was meant to be fair, but there was a few marks on it, you know, like stone chips on the front, mm -hmm. and like all the lads know I'm a fanny. So I took it to a painter that I know, and I said, Look, how much for the bumper of the bonnet? And anyway, he talked us into saying, Look, just get it all done. So thing, that's what it. I did. So he took it all down to bare metal. <laughs> I've got a load of photos and that, like the full restoration, but he's done a canny job, like full bare metal. Full bare metal. Did yeah. Like. Crazy. Do the job properly. Aye, Loads of powder like... coating underneath and all, all the bumper bars. All underneath, it's all been powder coated at the same time. So. Summer car as well, isn't it? Aye, it is. Aye. It doesn't normally come out in the winter. So. Aye. aye. I it's hope it's all right. It'll be all right. Yeah. No, no store chips today, I hope. Let's see. <laughs> Should we go for a drive, mate? Aye, aye. Long, uh... How long you had it? It'll be about two and a half years. Aye. What did you have before this? <sighs> I've had a lot. Of, like, I had a Westfield. Black I top Westfield aye, with throttle bodies on. Things. Mate, it was awesome. Like, black top, like a Ford engine there. Aye, black top, aye. Zinc neck things, aye. Aye, it had the Omex ECU in that. What was it, 2 litre? 2 litre black top, aye. About 180 oh, horsepower. But that weighed about, I did, I uh, About 480 kilos, I think it was. The power to weight was immense, like. But uh, I've had loads of stuff over 
of the years, like. Did you see you had a Series 1 Harvester? Aye, aye, years ago, aye. What was the wedge on that? C540 LRG it was. C540 LRG? Aye. It's I still run recently. Is it? Aye. Uh, it's what power is it? 375? It's a 375 conversion, but it's got loads of spec R bits with a big hook in the cooler. So it might be like Ford. Uh, it's got Ford British R, yeah. Yeah, loads of torque. I, uh, I had to Google it this morning. I, thought, I know you're going to answer us loads of, uh, ask us loads of questions. So I thought, <laughs> right, I'm going to Google this morning. But the conversion itself is about, I think it's about four and a half grand from is standard. Uh, Did you do it? No, I bought it as a 375. What's the weight on it? Uh, 1552 Tarmax. Is that what they're called? Aye. Uh, Big chunky five spokes, they look nice mine, I, I like them. Uh, I've gone through six sets of wheels this year. Have you? Aye, uh, six sets of wheels this year. Are man. they steered? I'll keep these, uh, but I've just bought another set. I've got my oh, own yeah. uh, bowl of CSRs. Right. So I tend to just buy them just to try on and just flip on. If uh, I can get them right. cheap, I'll just buy them. And, you know, it's just right. Just, Wait, isn't it? just like a pair of shoes or something? Chop and it's a hobby. It's a uh, hobby, like, because if I didn't do that, I'd probably want to change the car. You uh, know, right. like, buy something else. Uh, well, I still, I'm looking all the time. I think that's. I see. I think that's a car person. Needs like if you're sitting on the toilet, you just get. Ah, you do. Ah, you do. Ah, if you get half an hour on the city, it's the first thing I do. I'll see what parts you see online. eBay, you've got your standard searches and stuff. Yeah. Tell you where it's good. Not Facebook Marketplace. Ah, I was. You get some shape, by doing. Ah, but like it brings up all the local stuff. And sometimes you get a couple of gems locally, and you get. Oh, I wouldn't mind that. I can't have a look. Ah, the suspensions on this. Mount Chill Club Sport. Ah, is it chocks? Shocks and springs. Uh, uh, that coil rock rock out. Uh, uh, no, rock hard. It's a club sport spec, so it's got club sport suspension, uh, club sport brakes, six pot brakes. Ah, uh, they've got the big bits on it. Uh, but it is, it's well, I think it's a Bill Steam B12 setup, but they rock hard because it's got the um, hard race suspension arms and adjustable camera and that. Uh, Poly Bush, so it's, it's, it's rock hard. Uh, it's nice, it's alright, man, it's alright. Yeah, like, I wouldn't like anything I was driving every day. No? Nah, I'm too old for that now, like. I like the comfort of people. Ah, oh, you know, it's nice stuff. Well, you see, that was just a weekend toy, so it's a bad uh, it? When you're going down to Ford Fair now, I've got me and me and Have you? <laughs> it's a pretty nice car to drive on the motorway, though. It's not bad. Like, there's not that much drawn. It's uh, uh, it's all right. Six speed. Ah, uh, six speed, aye. Uh. Bit of aircon in that. You, you're mad for your aircon, you, aren't you? I need it, man. I'd say you drive that Sierra in the summer. It's just like loads of windows, and it's like massive in it, like the, the glass. Aye, right. and the engine just chucks out so much heat. Uh, like it just it comes through the vents even when they're off, do you know what I mean? When you sit in traffic and all, it just... Aye, uh, Bergen, absolutely Bergen. BMW lent us a convertible for a bit. And I was sitting in a traffic jam, normally like, when I'm in traffic, I'm getting fucks here, yeah, where am I get going, I want to get over. Do you know what I mean, I want to get where I'm going. But I was sitting in this convertible in a traffic jam, in the middle of summer, it was blaring the sun, the roof was down. I was like sitting in a park bench or something, uh, I was getting here, it's all right, it's take your time, do you know what I mean? Uh, sitting chilling out in the sun. Well, I guess the, the, the cause is the same for you, isn't it? Just like a weekend. Well, I, you they, wouldn't really... Like, I'll tap it out on the weekend, I'll tap it out for like an hour, get, get this warm, uh, get the Audi, uh, get the aircon on. Uh, just a big comfort, man. Like the cosy for me, it's something to look at, do you know what I mean? I like looking at it and tinkering with it and... Like, I would never drive it and get Ford for hour now. Would you not? No, never. On a motorway. It can't be that bad, can it? It's five speeds, so we're like, do you know what I mean? 60 miles an hour all the way. Oh, I think if you're doing like 70, like the revs are up, and it's going oh, <laughs> all the way, and you're bouncing. <laughs> the speakers are shit. Do you know what I mean? So you can, you're you're speakers now, aren't you? I would still kind of shite, do you know what I mean? It's not like what this will be. I've had these upgraded and all, got all the, you know, the dye, is it dye mat? That oh, silver reflective uh, gear, the doors and all that. Uh, it's got components in, but it's still like you look at the nav look, it's like it's 1990s at its best, isn't it? Uh, I, it's pretty shite. Well, I think it works. Uh, well, it works, I, I use that Wears now. Have you seen it? The app, even though I've got an iPhone, you the app called Wears. It's like sat nav, but people have marked on where the police are on both Wears and that. Really? Uh, Aye, it's really good. What's that called? Wears. Wears. W U Z E or something. Or I'll w A Z E. I said you're a link wood. Ah, it's well. Right. It's good. Need a bit of spit on it. It's got an eight, isn't it? This thing tells you your speed, I think. I'm sure about what it. It's like 80. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I know that bit out of it. Tell people that, like. <laughs> does it get good by like this, or does it? Ah, it does when it's dry. Like, low down gears. You first get second. Second. Uh, it's second, they're good, is it not? I mean, 
quite dry, but it's got the uh, triple eights on, so. You're fine. When the tyres get warm, it gets better. Aye. St. Crew and that, and then all the way along through Blackhall and up through here. And I didn't even want to park. I like just parking it right on the seafront. So if we get fish and chips or whatever, you can see it. Aye. It's just like. There's some old scrappy paper about one in there. Right, that's it, fellas. Thanks for watching. Uh, cheers, Christian. It's been, been good, mate. All right. You can catch up. Is there any social media you want to plug, anything like that? Aye, uh, so my social media, uh, Christian underscore RS dot can. No, it's not. Edit that out. It's wrong. <laughs> Is this your personal Instagram? Aye, uh, personal Instagram. I'll leave Christian's personal Instagram below in the description. Aye, uh, and then there's uh, Razzle Dazzle Detailing. They've right. done um, all the detailing on it, uh, ceramic coat and all that kind of stuff. If you're in the northeast, uh, place to go. Mm -hmm. um, Pete from Auto Spray, who painted it. Again, I'll leave the link or I'll mm -hmm. forward that on to you, Adam. Um, and Monkey Wrench Bespoke, who did the lights. So um, go and give Adam. Um, oh, I saw his name. Um, <laughs> uh, James, James a call. He'll sort give out. James a call. The headlights are pretty cool as well, aren't they? Ah, they are. They're pretty, they're pretty cool. cool then, Just right. a little bit different, that's all. Ah, I'll leave uh, the social media below for what Christian mentioned there. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll, uh, I'll see you soon. Spot on, yeah. Spot on. Sound. <laughs> <laughs>